Monster Hunter Try. When is, is that fucking the Water Temple in Ocarina of Time? The Great Bay Temple, even though I, I'm of the very small percent of people that think the Great Great Bay Temple isn't that bad. Why is it always water? Where where the game just where everything enjoyable of the game is just taken out, literally drowned. Turtle proved that being a reptile has advantages. Yeah, advantages. It'd be more advantageous if, if I didn't if I didn't run the risk of drowning. And if these guys didn't take half my health off. Why do they do so much damage? Like it wouldn't be so bad if they if they were just annoying. But no, they do so much damage. And when they swarm you, good luck surviving. And when they and then when they flank you, good luck not taking damage. And then when they pull you into the water when there's a million of them, good luck not dying. I hate these things. Die, die, die. But I'm going to do this. And I'm going to do this tonight. I'm going to do this now. I'm not going to give up until this and this till this watery area is finished. Alice, don't don't grab the ledge. Just jump up it. Life swift and true, my jacks. Find the enemy. If you see the enemy, kill the enemy. Find the fish. If God had wanted you to live, he would not have created me! Swift and true, my jacks. Love that they can do that. Love it. I hear you died. Good. I'll just take that essence, replenish the health you drained off of me, and we'll be gravy. Legitimately, this is the water temple. Yeah, this is the water temple, but in Alice. Find the enemy, Jax. Find the enemy and kill the enemy. Search and destroy. Anyone anyone else not dead? Hmm. That's not the answer. Wait, why did I come back here? What's the point of this? Do I need to break that? I 
guess not. <laughs> Maybe it's just something over here I need to go I need to go to. <laughs> Any assholes in here? Anyone wanna test me? Test the water, my jacks. Seems like they found something. Or at least one of them did. Maybe. Okay, now I'm confused. What to do and where to do it. That's up too high. Can't reach there. Where, where did all of these fish come from? 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 Destroy. I hate every single one of you. Stupid fish. Well, what the? Okay. I know you're in there. me. Maybe I have to go in here? I do. Oh god. Oh god. This is giving me such a Rusty Bucket Bay vibe. Oh god. This is giving me such a Rusty Bucket Bay vibe. Another example, Rusty Bucket Bay. Okay, where am I and how did I get here? Clearly by swimming, answering out of order, and I'm here apparently. Add Rusty Bucket Bay to that list of some, of water levels that just would would the game would do better without. Because I really do consider Rusty Bucket Bay a water level, even though it's kind of more a mechanical level. But I consider Gruntilda Industries much more of a mechanical level. Can't wait. That, that is de those are definitely games on the list of games that I do want to play for the channel. Jax, seek and destroy. Okay, you got one. Did you get the other? Just to be safe. Okay. Now that that's raised... Save real quick. Hmm. Just 
too quiet. I don't like it. What the? Die, 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 die. Where are you? Die. much health they can take off of me. You have to th you have to stop for a moment and think that might be a bit unfair with how many they're throwing at me and how much damage they can do and and how quickly the damage ticks. <sighs> Complain more blight, people like it. <laughs> It's like all they know how to do is complain. That's a good show. Even though that's one of the episodes I I didn't I hadn't watched very often. Chowder's just one of the oh, no 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 no. No, I this is It is Rusty Bucket Bay! Go figure. Yeah, it's pretty much exactly Rusty Bucket Bay. But Alice in Wonderland. Fun. I had enough of that level in Banjo Kazooie. I don't I don't want it in in my in my Alice game. No! No! You will not. This is just it, this is just death. This is just guaranteed death. You can do nothing to fight this. You can do nothing to fight this bull. This is bull. Get away from me! Get away from me! Oh, fish. Once I get to this oxygen... Once I get to these bubbles... Okay, you too, you too, too much of a... Let's see this some See it come fight me? That's fine. Stay out far away from the fan. Okay. Wait, what? Oh. Okay, since I feel like if if I get even slightly smacked with one of those one of those blades, it's gonna be an insta kill. I feel like I think I got out of that pretty easily though. So maybe I didn't need to save there. Is my paranoia getting the best of me? Maybe. But I feel like it's warranted. Especially with these assholes at every turn. Seek and destroy. Find and kill. No, you don't. Okay, no, you don't. That is some kind of bull right there. If they pull me into that water, I'd have to go through all that again so you can understand why I'm saving right there. Oh, 
I don't have enough to throw my jacks. Beautiful. Now leave me alone long enough for me to get in. Bravo! Bravo, you guys! You, you're just wonderful friends. Okay, get a round of applause for you assholes. Won't leave me alone for two seconds so I can- And I was at, like, practically full health, and two fish in, like, two s in, like, one second drained me to nothing. <laughs> Incredible. I'd hate to be playing this game on, on, any, on any other difficulty. GET AWAY FROM ME! I am so done with your bullshit. Get, get, get away, get away, get away, get away, die, 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 die. Calm, Blight, calm. Nothing to worry about. Why am I here underwater? Is there something over here? Perhaps, perhaps not. That is the question. Yes. I want you to go down in there. Oh my god, there's the ceiling. And you know they take too much health to give such to give such small meta essence. Complain, complain, complain. Bitch, 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 moan, moan, moan. Oh, game is too hard. Game is hard. Oh, wow. Hopefully we don't have to deal with any more water bullshit. <laughs> oh, good God. Where am I? How do I get down from here? Okay. I see you. Yeah, I got you. I got this on camera. Yo, Alice, aim! Why do they take so many? Alright. What are these noises? I don't know what it's reminding me of. It's either Crash Twin Sanity or, uh, or Psychonauts. Both great games. Again, more games I, want, I definitely want to play on the channel at some point. Whoa! Could you not? I know your oh, your modus operandi is to make me is to make me drink that lava, but I'd rather you didn't. You know? Have you ever thought about how I feel? There are also lava fish here. Lovely. Hmm. I think it is cra Crash to Insanity, like, uh, the, 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 uh, the other world. The alternate dimension place. 
It's got music that that makes weird no that makes weird noises like that. Get him. These jacks are wonderful. nervous now because like the, the game's difficulty has definitely spiked. Oh gosh. But it, it also gives me a, a bit of hope because the, because the fact that the difficulty has spiked so much is just telling that we might be near the end of the game. We are in apparently Queen of Hearts land. So who knows? Who knows how close we are to the end? Well, other than people who've played this before. Which I, th I feel like might be very few. This is, a rather, this is a rather obscure one. Okay, I didn't. I, did, I wanted to go check what was over there, but I guess I'm going up here. Oh, I don't need that. Not right now, at least. Mental notes. Might need that in the future. I'm glad it's there. Go. Hey. Don't scare me like that. There's always spooks like that. You know, I looked into uh, into American McGee, and and I didn't I didn't uh, I feel like I didn't expound on what I was talking about. Not uh, like. Not a couple episodes, but several episodes ago. The fact that A, there is an Alice 3 in the works, and B, well, so, well, let me talk about Alice 3 real quick. There's not much information right now, but it, but it, it's it's apparently happening, and I'm and I'm honestly excited. I had heard that there was apparently. And, uh, an Alice movie that was supposed to happen, but EA canned it or something. Don't don't take don't take uh, my word as a as a reference, but I, I feel like I heard that somewhere that there was going to be an American McGee's Alice movie, but that but uh, EA was like, no, let's not do that. Waste of money. No one will watch. No one knows what this is. But I would watch. I would make sure to go to the theaters and see that. I'd see it in 3D. And despite people who and despite people who love quoting a la carte that the, the 3D is a stupid gimmick and everyone knows it, yeah, it's a gimmick. But I think that in, in the right places and in the right amounts, 3D can actually make a movie viewing experience just that much more of an experience, you know. Yeah, it's stupid, and 3D TVs are stupid, and anyone who has a th and anyone who has a 3DS probably only turns it on just to be like, oh, I wonder what this looks like in 3D. They turn it on and be like, oh, cool, and then they turn it off. Like I can guarantee you, I've had my 3DS for like, um, gosh, how long? For like probably six years now. Yikes. And I I swear I've only put like one hour of t of time with the 3D feature turned on with it. Like, at most, one hour. Approximately, maybe. I don't know. Like I said, it's one of those things where I wonder what this looks like in 3D, and then you flip it on and then be like, oh, cool. And then you turn it off. 
I don't understand people buying the inferior console, the 2DS, and be just because, oh, it doesn't have 3D. Why would I buy 3D? Because 3D is a stupid fucking gimmick and everyone knows it. Yes, I know you're quoting Alucard. Y y you're, you certainly are original. Look, I can get I can get not liking 3D, but when your excuse is is a quote from a character from an internet series, forgive me for me for for having a few jokes about that. Yes, 3D is a, is kind of a stupid gimmick, but I say that it can that it's in small doses it can make an experience just that much more well of an experience. Like, I saw Zootopia and Kung Fu Panda 3 in 3D, and I don't regret it. I honestly really did enjoy the experience. Okay, now let's, let's try to not die here. Okay. Let me save real quick. But the 2DS, ugh, like, the new 2DS, fine, it's it's much more of a sturdy console, but the original 2DS, I, I wouldn't give that to a child, because it, 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 the plastic is like, toy grade plastic, it's, it doesn't even have the iconic clamshell design, you can't tote it anywhere unless you have like, a, a, a 2DS toting case and a strap. I'm fine with the new 2DS. I'm not fine with the old 2DS. The only re and the only reason people bought the 2DS is because a cheap. I don't know why you would th why you would think, hey, I want to get a game console. Let me get it as cheaply as I possibly can by by a uh, forfeiting har by forfeiting hardware sturdiness and. Uh, Getting a getting a version that just removes features, and like I said, I bear, I almost never use my use the 3D on my 3DS. It's just it's just one of, it's just a cool thing that I'm like okay let's let's see what this looks like. Get get away from me! I need that essence. Don't don't even. Get onto the things that I'm using. <sighs> that took a lot more health and magic than I wanted it to. Hey, it's baffling that people actually did buy the 2DS because well, the original 2DS because it's a version of a of a great console that takes away that takes away, oh god. That was a stupid idea. It's a version of a console that takes away features that doesn't even have the the clamshell design to make it portable like it's meant to be. You ha you'd have to get a carrying case for it just to make it a portable system, which it is. The, the normal 3DS, even the even the 3DS XL can fit in your pocket, but the original 2DS doesn't. I mean, it's just baffling. I, I don't understand it. But the new 2DS is fine because it does have the clamshell design. It does it it it's it is made of sturdy actual video game console grade plastic. It's more of a legit console and less of a toy, you know? All of this to say I, w I would go see... I would go see American McGee's Alice the movie in theaters in 3D. But uh, apparently that's not gonna happen. Because that's not... it's not a thing that's happening. But American... but... But Alice 3 is gonna is gonna happen at some point. Other than that, American McGee, the guy who ma who made this game and the sequel, okay, apparently he's ha he has quite a history with uh, its software, with uh, 
Quake and Doom and and you know all, all of that stuff. And it kind of shows in this game's A design, B gameplay. That apparently that, that apparently American McGee is like one of John Carmack's best friends. Apparently. And it's funny, you really only hear about no. <sighs> you really only hear about like John Car about John Carmack and John Romero when you're when you're talking about uh, id software. But apparently American McGee is just as important. God, I had to go through all this again. Like, can you do the world a favor and not be dumb? Could you die? All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna save once we get to a certain point. Did you? Ah! Oh my God! Is this going to be the worst run through of this? I, I I'm starting to think maybe. Third time's the charm to drive you crazy. There we go. Whew. I don't know when LS3 is gonna happen. It's just, it's just, uh, it's just, it's just in the works right now. So there's no clue. Did you take no damage? There we go. Knife is best friend. Knife is good. Ooh. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> oh, we're doing this again. We're doing this again. No, no, you will not. You will not do this to me. Not again. Not you guys. I won't let this happen. Give me your essence. I'll move forward. You will die. We're gonna take it slowly. We're gonna take. We're gonna do it methodically. We're gonna make sure nothing bad happens. If you kill me, there is there is swift, painful retribution with your name on it. Were you not taking damage? Now give me that 
essence of yours. Delicious easels. Jax! There we go! Efficiency! Just saved. And we can go, we can go take care of that asshole. We can make sure he dies painfully. I got I got overzealous. Saint of, of of actually getting shit done without without it being being rebuked by ineptitude. want to get out of this maze area. <laughs> what the hell? Hey, cat. How goes it? Give me a hug. Cat's my buddy. Not a fan of this. I'm not a fan of the fact that there's things trying to attack me while well, I'm just trying to go through! I see the time. But I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to stop yet. Did you just die? Did you just die hilariously? Crap! Not that far. 
to save when we need to. guys that I like seeing each time you show up. Finally, freedom. Please. Time to jump in, time to jump through time. I'm dizzy. <laughs> oh, good. A clock tower stage. <laughs> this game just has it all, doesn't it? Uh, I, I genuinely mean that. This game is actually pretty great. Despite how frustrated I get at it. The fact that I want to keep playing it is just a testament to how much this game has drawn me in. Like, I believe that it's always a good game that you can get mad at and just keep wanting to play rather than just turn it off, you know? I, I hope I hope you get that. But yeah, next episode, good god, what do we have in store for us?